Beyonce, Queen Bey, I pray that you make my feet swift tomorrow, and that you make my moves have swagger. In the name of the single ladies video and the lemonade short film, I pray. Five, six, seven, eight. Hey, Sabrina. Hey, Liza. Thank you so much for your time. It's a pleasure to be talking to you both. And Sabrina, I want to know what attracted you to this project. So many things. I think from day one, like I knew this was going to be such a fun movie to make um, and it was going to be a process and it was going to be a lot of hard work. And I think all those things were enticing to me and um, and obviously just the talented cast that we had on board. Uh, and yeah, I think the idea of making a dance movie is something that I always wanted to do. I didn't think I'd get to play a character that was uh, so complex uh, when it came to her character arc um, and, and having to kind of start in a place where I can't dance at all and end up in a place where um, I can dance a little bit better. Um, so that's why it was a lot of fun. I, th I think uh, I think the experience is what made it really, really indelible though and, and getting to film in Toronto with such a talented cast and crew of people such as Liza Koshy. What stop? Yeah. He was Sabrina Carpenter. That's why I took on the role. There's no other reason. That's what um, it was. But also dancing, I really like dancing too. So oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a little bit, a little bit here and there. But it was an honor to dance with all the Toronto wing dancers. Yeah, that's awesome. And Liza, what do you like the most about Jess? Oh, she is a deep and nuanced character. There's many layers. Um, she is. I think she's fearless, and or there's a little bit of fear there where she's like, "Ah, oh, should I leave the dance team?" And yeah. then she does. You know, like Quinn, Quinn reaffirms her like, ah, it's too late. You're with me now and you trust me and you love me. So you're going to do anything for me. Damn right I do. So <laughs> I think there is this, this fearlessness and this unapologetic uh, attitude that comes from Quinn that rubs off on Jazz that reaffirms her that she can do this and she can step away from this team and the certain path that she thought she had to take to get to New York and be a dance uh, major there. Um, but I think she realizes like through her best friend and through their relationship that like, nah, we can do this in our own way and on our own time and, you know, pave our own path. So I like, I love the, um, just a relationship. You just, you lean on your best friend and you, you just go on an adventure and enjoy the journey. You enjoy the journey together more than the destination, but let's we'll see what the destination is. You just got to watch, work it and see where we end up. Oh, I guess so. Oh. Oh yeah, that's right. No, no spoiler here. <laughs> and for you, Sabrina, what is difficult for you to pretend not knowing how to dance? I wish it was more difficult. Uh, it was. It was almost like I, I just it concerned me how easy it became over time. Like it just then became like I couldn't dance anymore. Um, no, it, it was. It was actually so much fun because normally where I'm so worried about being perfect all the time or, or, or hitting moves like precisely and clean. I think um, the fun thing about Quinn was like, I really couldn't do any wrong because, you know, it was, it was something that she was just being awkward and, and trying to find her, her body language, uh, which did not exist for most of the film. So um, it's, it was a little hard in the beginning, but it became a lot easier as, as time went on and I just got more and more into character. Yeah, that's awesome. The message is really good too. I love it. The way that you, your queen involved in the in the whole movie and all the dancing and everything and i cannot wait for everybody to watch this when it comes out on netflix I appreciate it yeah. much, girl. thank yeah. you thank you so much for your time ladies and a lot of success thank you so Bye. much thank you. thank you thank you Did he just fall asleep to Big Frida? If you like this video, don't forget to comment, to like, and subscribe to our channel right here.